Welcome to Special T1Ms. In this first episode, we are going to teach you how to test your glow plugs using a homemade fused jumper assembly. All you do is you take some small gauge wire, two uh, spade connectors, females, one male spade connector, and a 25 amp fuse. You're probably going to need more than one fuse. All you do is you reach down underneath your battery tray that's where the uh, glow plug controller is. And when you unplug the large plug and pull it up, you'll see the whole thing is numbered. Now when you look at it, you've got one, three, and five, and two, four, and six, right? Notice number six does not have anything going to it. So what we're gonna do, is we're going to take this, I'm going to start with number two, I'm going to plug in the male spade into the connector, just like so. Now, when you touch the, pos the bare wire to the positive terminal, there's nothing, no results, right? That is the sign of a good glow plug. Now I go to terminal one right next to it and see if you can see this instantly. The fuse blue. That tells me that glow plug number one is bad. So, how do we go about changing the glow plugs? Well, the very first thing you're going to need to do is take time. You can't just go in and change the plugs. Get some good penetrant. This is Deep Creep by Seafoam. And we're going to spray each of the glow plugs down and let the penetrant do its job. It's not an overnight job either. In the next episode, we will go through the actual procedure to change the glow plugs. Until then, we're going to use heat cycles and more penetrant for a period of one week. And that's all for today. See you next time.